we're off to a wedding with our Steve Hartman. <laughs> Troy and Katie Hudson of Denver, Colorado say their wedding was going just as they planned until the reception when a member of the wedding party stole the show. So it wasn't something that we were necessarily prepared emotionally to hear. He's just like, I'm doing what I want to do. Here we go. And he's passionate. He's also nine. I wasn't planning on making a speech for her. Katie. But I did it. I let it out. And I can't pause it. In a minute, what Katie's little brother had to say. But first, what led him to this moment? She's just the best sister I can ask for. No one can compare. You try one of these. Gus is actually Katie's half-brother. They're separated by nearly two decades, <laughs> yet close as conjoined. <laughs> Which is why, when Katie got engaged, Gus says his feelings got complicated. I was worried that she would not spend as much time with me as she used to. Mm -hmm. So it was really stressful in that way because I didn't want to lose her. Fortunately, Gus says there's just something about a wedding ceremony. It's just like, kind of like magic. And most of my worries about them just kind of went away. Which brings us back to the reception. And I am so happy that you guys got married today. And I know I might seem a little sad up here, but these are tears of joy. <laughs> As the holidays approach and far off relatives begin to trickle in, Gus says his story should be a reminder to you to never let the word extended cloud the word family. Don't let that separate you because you deep down love them and they deep down love you. Toastworthy advice. Oh my gosh.